Uh, this product is called uh, a Uric for Universal Interface Controller. And basically you can have two radios in or a radio and a cell phone in and a, a headset out. The headset can be an over the ear, an in the ear, or a throat mic. So the advantage of this is um, with two push to talks, so you can toggle back and forth between the two radios. It's got a mode switch that allows you to toggle through four modes. The first mode is if you had to put on a gas mask and you wanted to be able to communicate, this is a voice projection unit. So you can talk to other people with a gas mask on. It has a mode that uh, if you were a sniper or a uh, SWAT person, and for instance, you're, in a, you're a SWAT person, you're in a building, and you're up against a wall and you think you hear footsteps and you know it's not your guys. If you had this earpiece plugged in, and the reason this earpiece has to works with that mode, if I plug this over the ear earpiece in, I can hear what's being said because it's an over the ear. The in the ear you can't hear. Okay, okay so I'm, a, I'm the SWAT guy, I'm in a building, I think I hear footsteps. I can turn on a hearing enhancement mode which amplifies the surrounding sound pretty dramatically. So now, I, I, in fact, I do hear somebody and the person's coming at me. So, so I need to let somebody know. The next mode I can go into is a tone mode. So now I can send tones, you know, one for help, two, for sending the troops, three to get out of Dodge, I can send tones. And so I've amplified the surrounding noise, I've communicated, and I haven't said a word. Okay? Uh, there's another function on this that um, if you press and hold one of these push to talks, it will become voice activated. So every time you talk, you can hear and talk without having to press and hold, press, press, press. How long do you have to hold it, Dave? Two seconds. Two seconds, press and hold, and now you've got the voice activated. Um, you don't accidentally do that. No, you don't. You've got to want to do it. Yeah. <laughs> um, it has a, an internal speaker function, and those are the four basic menu buttons with the hearing enhancement when you have the earphone, the in-ear earphones in. Um, it runs on a single AA battery. The battery is good for four hours. To turn it on, you simply press and hold for four seconds. It, there's an audible alert. When you have this on um, and you go through the menus, it, it talks to you. The unit okay. talks to you. So you always know say, in the menu yeah, where you're at and, and what it's doing. So the other function that this has that is, that is pretty neat, these two buttons can be controlled wirelessly by this, we call it a WIC, it's a wireless interface controller. So where would, this, where would this have an application? Suppose you're a paratrooper and you got two paddles and you have two radios. You can't let go of the paddle or the handle and talk on the radio because you start to spiral down. So what we did for the Special Forces folks at Fort Bragg is we took two of these wicks and we put one on each handle. So now he jumps out of the plane, he can talk on his command radio to the plane or the people on the ground, and he can talk on his tactical radio to the people he's falling with. So that's, that's an advantage for the two wicks. Um, we did a demo for the U.S. Marine Corps where they had a, a vehicle that had two joysticks. Well, you can't let go of the joystick and operate the vehicle to answer the radio. So we, we strapped one of these to one of six guys in back. There was a driver, a driver, the commander in the passenger seat, and there was a gunner. And the vehicle had a 30 millimeter cannon on top, and he had a TV screen, and he would run the gun from the TV screen. So this you can have um, three headsets.